all current ticket holders can access um, but what he means by that I don't know what there will be to access how much access you will get um, whether you had to buy your tickets by a certain period of time I, I don't know okay so um, here is the video that I I'm not surprised that I have to be making um, but a video that I never wanted to be making um, if you're here because of the title or Body Power 2020 is cancelled, uh, you're in the right place. Unfortunately, the expo has, well, it's been postponed until the 30th, 31st of October and the 1st of November. Um, so, before we get into this, um, I want to say that I understand. I, I understand that the health of the general public is far more important and I will be speaking to Nick, the CEO of the Expo, um, very, very soon. Um, well, ASAP, really, um, to kind of discuss what's happened, purely because it's 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 a very big deal, um, a very big deal, and you guys and myself, t to be honest. I want an explanation. Um, I want to know what's happened because I have a feeling that this is out of Body Power's control. I have a feeling that this is, um, you know, the, the, the government kind of forcing Body Power's hand, if you like. I don't think Nick would have cancelled the expo unless he had to. Either that or the fact is that the expo wouldn't have been what everybody wanted it to be or expected it to be because, let's be honest, athletes coming from all over the world. Uh, wouldn't have been able to come from from all over the world so um, anyone that knows me knows that I I love the expo it is more than just an expo to me it is literally I mean I, I crashed my car on my on my way to the first body power I ever went to and so I still made it to that body power 2015 it was um, and so I get this feeling of, of overwhelming kind of whoosh of, of, of life, if you like, when I walk through the door, which might sound silly to some, I know, but until you've crashed at 90 mile an hour on the frigging motorway, um, no, I wasn't going that fast, I was going the speed limit, <laughs> until you've crashed on the motorway and still made it for the first time to something like that, it's it's kind of hard to, to understand and, and comprehend. I don't expect other people to, to understand that, but that is the, um, the case for myself anyway. So... Um, I'm making this video to <laughs> share um, the bad news with you guys. Uh, I'm I'm gutted. I'm I'm absolutely gutted. Um, I, I want you guys if if you are um, in in fact before I get into that, if you've booked a hotel. Um, change the dates now because the expo will still go ahead the things with the booths and everything like that that will still go ahead on the 30th of the 31st and the um, 1st of November so if you've booked a hotel for the 15th to the 17th or whatever the dates are just change the dates don't retract your payment don't cancel the hotel just ring and you don't even necessarily have to explain the whole situation just be like look I still want to stay with you but can I change the dates I think that is the best way to approach it rather than being like the expo's cancelled you've got to give me my money back and then in a few months time you end up wanting to book the the um, same hotel again right so just change the dates or try to anyway um, uh, but as far as I know, um, I've spoken to, I'll tell you what, let me pull my phone out. I've spoken to Nick, the CEO. So if you're new here, um, I did an interview with Nick, who is the CEO of Body Power, and it's actually Steve and Nick, Steve's son, who kind of did this announcement together this afternoon sort of thing. Um, Body Power have put the story up uh, on their page. Body Power, the latest information. Um, it has been confirmed today, the 13th of the 3rd, 2020, that Body Power will be postponed from May until Friday the 30th, Saturday the 31st, and Sunday the 1st of November. Some of the competitions will run as scheduled in May. However, the main expo, including competitions, athletes, stands, features, and so on, will now be taking place in some halls in late October slash November. So, some, I don't know to what extent that means, um, but some of the competitions are still going ahead some things are going to still be happening i don't know what or to what extent or how 
uh, how big it will, will be, if you like. Um, I mean, Body Power gets over 100,000 people for the weekend. There's not going to be 100,000 people uh, visiting the NEC in May now, I tell you. Um, the health of our visitors, exhibitors, athletes and staff is at the forefront of our decision. Completely understand that. To postpone Body Power from May until late October. Um, this is actually the same for a lot of things right now. Everything left, right and centre. In fact, two of my, fav my two favourite events of the year Body Power and Radio One's Big Weekend got cancelled within an instant of each other in the same frigging breath. Myself and Dad were actually trying to change the dates for our hotel for the later dates now. Um, and in the meantime, Scott Mills came on Radio One and announced that they were cancelling Big Weekend. And my life just came crumbling down. I, I say it as a joke, but like these two, like I like I like big events and stuff, and it's just to go from having to wait you know six or seven weeks to six or seven months again now is um it's just a bit shitty to be honest but you, you've got to put <laughs> you've got to put the general population's health ahead of it and i i'm gutted i'm absolutely gutted and to be honest i had to take my time to film this video purely because i, I was a bit emotional like i, I was I, I will say it i was a bit emotional that the expo got cancelled it means that much to me i was excited about the expo you know i know people compete in there i was just excited for everything that i'm doing especially right now is leading up to body power um and so it's 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 a massive 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 shame but you know it it is what it is sort of thing you, you just got to play the cards you dealt in this life and I feel like Body Powers was, was dealt a shit hand here, you know, they can't really do anything about it. So, given the current circumstances surrounding the spread of COVID-19, have I said that right, uh, virus, we will be unable to deliver the expo to the high standard we hold ourselves to. As a team, we hate to let anyone down. However, we would also hate for anyone's experience to be anything less than amazing. Yeah, they've written this very well. We wanted to alert everyone to the change in dates now uh, to give as much notice as possible. Yes, also a very good thing to be doing because the Arnold um, in Ohio that's just gone, I, if I'm honest, I've never been to the expo or anything like that. I didn't like the way that they dealt with that. They knew the extent of the coronavirus. They should have let people know earlier, you know, uh, Mark LeBliner, of, as in MTS Nutrition, he's made a video basically explaining that he's been to the um, Arnold Ohio for 15 years running, bar one year, and he's paid like 10 grand this year and stuff, and they're not giving him his money back and stuff. Um, so uh, it'll be interesting to see what's happening with, with booths and stuff, um, about people getting their money back, flights being booked and all this kind of stuff. Like, Body Power can't be responsible for the flights. They, they they just can't they can be responsible for the booths i guess but i i don't know i'll ask nick in in that video i've actually spoken to him we are going to be filming a video um asap uh, as far as i'm concerned um i am ready to talk with him at monday morning 9 a.m um so hopefully he'll watch this and, and get back to me a little faster. I'm sure his phone is blowing up right now. So we wanted to alert everyone to the change in dates now to give as much notice. Oh, I just read that bit. As much notice as possible. We thank you in advance for your understanding while we as a team work through the ramifications of the situation. Furthermore, we look forward to a spectacular expo in October and can't wait to see you then. Um, so... Uh, that, 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 that's that people it's happened it's happening um, I've been getting messages for a long time now thinking what do you think about coronavirus what's what's gonna happen to yeah you know, I actually put a question tab up on my Instagram yesterday and it would have been a pointless question it would have been a pointless Q&A to film for YouTube because every single question bar two or three was about coronavirus and body power um, so I'm going to do my best to provide as much content, as much coverage, get you guys as much information for, for myself as well, to be honest. Um, I would like to know the kind of ins and outs of this situation and, and why it's had to go down the way it's had to go down. Um, but I do think it's it's been handled in the correct way. You can't give people any more notice than this. You know, people at the end of the day are dying from this. You have to take it seriously. You can't have 100,000 people um, in the same place just at the end of the day you go there to say hello give them a high five give them a hug take pictures you know you you you, you touch each other it sounds stupid but you you know you 
it's impossible for every single person to remain completely 100% hygienic the entire of the time. You know, people, it's hot in there, you get sweaty, and viruses are like thrive in sweaty environments and stuff. I, I get it. I really, really do get it. Um, like I say, um, I'm gutted, especially because a lot of what I personally had planned um, was kind of building up towards body power and doing it towards body power. If you are a competitor, um, as far as I know, your competition is still going ahead. So please um, stay positive, stay happy, stay on track smash those goals if you can't get to the gym because um your your gym is now closed um i will be releasing a video on what you can potentially kind of do um training wise uh in and around this kind of difficult time where everything starts basically going a bit tits up you know like everything has to we, we have to start working differently to to kind of defeat this virus you know um so I wanted to uh, make this video purely because, uh, well, I, I feel like <sighs> it sounds silly. Um, I feel like it was. I'm getting all hot and sweaty. I'm going to take this jumper off. Um, it feels almost a little bit like helpful for me to be recording this video and almost just ranting and venting about it a little bit, um, which might sound silly to some. I I realise that. But um, the extent of how important this expo and this weekend is to me um, is very high. You know, it's of very high importance to uh, to me. But like I keep saying, I, I, I get it. I understand. Um, and I've actually just had a message from a friend of mine, John, who is competing um, at the expo. I don't know the answer to it. See, this is the thing, right? My, uh, my messages are kind of blowing up right now because everybody knows how much I love body power. They want to let me know. Um, I appreciate it if you have sent me the message, but unfortunately I do know now. <laughs> You know, uh, I actually knew before the announcement went up because someone sent me a screenshot of uh, Steve's LinkedIn post. So it went up on LinkedIn, then it went up on Instagram, I think. And I assume Facebook and email and everything followed that. Um, it might not have been in that order, but anyway. Uh, that is that, people. Um, that's, that's it. That's the situation. Um, stay positive. We go again. Together we will grow. Stay, seriously, stay on, stay on track if you are dieting right now if you're whether it's for a competition or whether you were dieting from for, for body power don't say off oh, fuck it you know S stick stick to it stay with it please like please do just for the sake of of fucking you know just please just <laughs> just don't don't let it don't let it get you down because I, I was letting it get me down um, for a little while you know I was a bit kind of to and fro in with, with the old man speaking about it. I was a bit kind of like, oh, I'm okay, I get it. And then I was like, no, actually, I'm really sad about this. And then I was like, oh, okay, uh, I, I get it. And I was like, no, actually, I, I, I'm really sad. And it just went like this, found out about two hours ago now, and here I am filming this video. So I've waited for my dip to finish, and I've come back up, and I, I'm at my understanding phase, <laughs> hence why I'm recording it now, rather than when I was in my sad phase. Um, is there anything else I need to add? I'm not entirely sure. Uh, let's see, let me actually just see some of these messages that I've been sent. Nick has said, all current ticket holders can access, um, but what he means by that, I don't know what there will be to access, how much access you will get, um, whether you had to buy your tickets by a certain period of time, I, I don't know, um, but oh my days, like my, my friggin messages these are all unread messages now jeez oh, okay um i'm gonna wrap this video up here guys just wanted to give you the update stay strong stay positive together we will grow and um yeah we're you know we'll, we'll get through this at the end of the day it's for the greater good the expo has just been postponed if you're competing you still get to compete um it's, I'm not going to say it's all good because it's not it's, it's devastating I'm freaking gutted but anyway um if you have enjoyed this video, like, comment, share, subscribe, all that YouTube stuff. It's still a YouTube video, isn't it? So, anyway, um, that's it. Body Power 2020 cancelled. It's going to be in my title anyway. I know it's not cancelled. It's just kind of postponed. Um, stay tuned. If you're new here, subscribe. I'll be talking to the CEO, Nick, very, very soon. And, um, yeah, that's that. 
much love i appreciate you and i'll see you in the next one which won't make any sense because i'm talking about building up to body power i've just realized this I'm talking to, i'm gonna sound like an idiot right i've got like two half prepped videos where i kind of talk about body power or oh, well i'm doing this and then it's body power and then I'm t so you're just gonna have to kind of bear with me for those next couple of videos bear in mind that they were filmed before this kind of news came out so i'm not just being an idiot um i just didn't know at the time so uh yeah I think we're good. That's it. Uh, coronavirus strikes body power. But um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.